I don't think I'm re- I don't think I don't think I don't, I think I don't, I don't think I don't think I'm ready for a relationship. But then again, how do you even know? <laughs> how do you even know that you are ready for a relationship? Like how da 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 ha ha ho how da how does that even happen? How do you even know right in your gut? How 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 do you even know that you're gonna get with like a random person? And then, like, get to, re- like, really know him. Then he get him alone. Ah. Oh, ah. Oh, ah. Oh, and go ahead and smash. And you go ahead and you... You tell him everything real deep down inside. You tell him real things that you don't tell everyone. You know? And then... And then you feel it out, and you're like, oh, my God, I like this person. I was like, this is a real good person right on up over this way. For me, personally, for this boy, boy, I've been through, like, I think, like, maybe five different, like, five different relationships. One and a half. Real relationships, like it's like a real relationship, or it's just like y'all are bonded. One and a half, and I'm like, I'm young, but I'm not young anymore. It's like I'm 22. Granted, I ain't gonna get married till I'm like, I ain't, I ain't gonna get married till I'm like 30, I think. Because, like, a lot of people, they think that they go here and go ahead and have kids, like, when they're, like, 12 and, and they're, like, oh, I want to go ahead and be, like, the cool mom. I want to go ahead and be, like, real close to my kid. I'm going to go ahead and be, like, buddies with all. For me, I want to be a dad. I want to be, like, 30 or something. I want to be, like, not old, but I want to be, like, older and aged like fine wine. Have a whole bunch of wisdom on up in my brain before I go ahead and have kids and everything like that on up over that way. And it's like, I don't really know if I'm ever going to be mature enough for relationships. Because there's so many girls I'm... So many special ladies out there that are so beautiful. I saw, I seen this very beautiful woman earlier. I didn't talk to her at all because I didn't want another girl that I got to go ahead and talk to about. I don't know that way. But, oh, my God, I seen this girl earlier, and she had, like, black hair, and she had, like, lipstick on, some glasses, and she looked professional. She looked pretty as hell. And I said, I want to get to that level where I can go ahead and talk, talk to a girl like that, and they actually have some interest for a girl because, yes, you can have washboard abs, you can go ahead and have a fatal. I don't have fading right, right now, and you get a haircut. You can go ahead and be looking so cool. You can be so you can be the coolest motherfucker. You can go ahead and go talk to any girl, you get them in the bedroom every single time. You can be that dude. If you ain't right with yourself, if you ain't if you ain't got nothing like how I was a couple of weeks ago, where you ain't have no car, you ain't got no job, you ain't care about life at all, you ain't got no aspirations, you ain't got no joy for life, you ain't got nothing at all deep down inside, ain't no girl gonna fuck with you long term. But I'm pretty fucking interesting like my day to day isn't normal like I'm I'm not a motherfucker who gonna go ahead and sit in a habit 
for the rest of his life. Like, every single moment is so strange with me, especially in real life. Like, it's like, because that's what, that's what I love about YouTube. Because I know once I go ahead and I get millions and millions of subscribers and get people who actually, like, like get to a point where I can go ahead and create something consistently in a long term of where people, like, like me and they want to go ahead and meet me in person and shit like that. Like... Like, I'm so hyped for that because I know I'm right with myself and my gut that I can go ahead and be like, what's up? Like, go, like, like go to them people and be like, you know, there's your selfie. All right, you go ahead and have a good day or whatever, you know, I don't know, that way. But I'm still a little fucked up in the head. I'm still a little fucked up. Because my last relationship, I should have took way better care of her. I should have took way better care of her because I didn't understand that to find someone who actually cares about you is so rare. It's like rarer than diamonds, it's rarer than gold. It's more valuable, it's more, it's, it's everything. It's, it's everything to find people who actually care about you. And it's just like, I don't know if I want to go ahead and interject myself into other people's lives yet. Because <sighs> I don't know if my foundation is strong, is built strong enough yet to start building on right now. But we're going to find out. I'll tell you that right now. We're going to go ahead and find out.